Hi, I'm John Peter, Plant Records Manager at the New York Botanical Garden. The garden is home to thousands of plant species, and I'm here to tell you one of them in this video plant profile. We're here in the newly renovated Azalea Garden because today's plant profile features the genus Rhododendron. Rhododendrons and azaleas have been known and growing for centuries, and as a result, there are now over 25,000 registered cultivars. In the new azalea garden, over 3,000 individual azalea and rhododendron plants have been installed, representing over 270 different types of azalea and over 60 different types of rhododendron. The most asked question that we receive in the azalea garden is what is the difference between rhododendrons and azaleas? These two groups of plants were once considered separate genera, but over a hundred years ago, taxonomists merged the genus azalea into the genus rhododendron, based on the close relationship between the two groups. What distinguishes an azalea from a rhododendron is that azaleas have five or six stamens, and most rhododendrons have ten or more. The second major distinction is that azaleas will never have scales on the leaves, and rhododendrons do have scales on the leaves. The last morphological characteristic that distinguishes the two groups is that the hairs on the leaves of azaleas differ from those found on rhododendrons. Thanks for joining me for this video plant profile. For more information, visit nybg.org.